The federal lawsuit against Governor Kemp's voter purge now moving forward. The lawsuit involves voters removed from roles between 2016 and 2018 when Mr. Kemp was Secretary of State. It alleges that Governor Kemp used racially biased mythology to remove 700,000 legitimate voters. It comes down to something called cross-check, a list of voters a handful of states use to double-check people who aren't registered in more than one state. The plaintiffs want access to that list. The governor's lawyers say they shouldn't have it because Georgia didn't end up using the list. Last week, the judge said she was leaning toward the plaintiff's side but gave the defense 30 days to explain why she shouldn't. After that, the plaintiffs have two weeks to respond. The judge will then issue a final decision. If the judge sides for the plaintiffs, they will get access to that cross-check list to see if anyone was mistakenly removed from those voter rolls.